Hello friends, my name is Kisan and welcome you in this video tutorial. In this video tutorial, basically we are going to discuss about the compatibility with date and calendar with new Java uh, 8 date and time API. So here basically we will learn how we can convert old date into new uh, date. So basically Java 8 has added two instant method which helps to convert existing date and calendar instance to new date time api so you can see on this slide uh, we have a local date time and local date time this is a, a class which has been added in jdk 1.8 so this class has a method is called off instant it's a static method so directly you can call by class name then you can pass the local i mean uh, date which is from the previous JDK version that is and that that basically we import from the Java dot util dot date so that date uh, class Java has also added one uh, method that is instance method so you can call on date instance so date dot to instance and here basically I have passed just system default zone ID in that way you will get the instance of local time if you have a instance of calendar then calendar dot to instance and here just we have passed I mean def system default time zone and again uh, if you have a simple date instance then you can convert into corresponding local date time using first line of code and you have a calendar instance then you can convert the same using second line of code over here now let's go to the Eclipse and try to explore these things through an example so here I have created a class and in this class basically I'm going to convert old date right so we have a new date and so basically this import will happen from java.util.date and this date we want to convert into corresponding local date time so local date time and local date time as I said ha has added a method is called off sorry that is with local date time uh, sorry local date time I wanted to add and left side also you have a local date time with the variable name as local date time and this has a off instant method and look at here this method is taking instant as well as zone id as a parameter so if you call a method is called in java dot util dot date class they have added a method is called to instant which is it returns you the instance of instant and here zone id i'm going to pass system default okay so this is the first way to convert uh, if you have a date object then you can convert corresponding local date time and if you try to sorry if you try to print it print the same now we can run it and we get the I mean today's date and current time which is separated with the uh, alphabet T now if you want to convert I mean old date into local date or local time class then if there is they haven't provided any off instant method in local date or local time but we know that if we have a local date time instance then we have a method is called to local date and local time so you can extract because local date time is a combination of both right local date as well as local time so you can extract 
or you can create local time instance from local date time right and similarly if you have a local date time then to local time you have a method right so you can accept time as well so if you try to print it so local time to then this this will this is going to print only date uh, sorry time uh, what time actually I have extracted only time right so second time I want to okay, local date so this one going to print you only time which will extract it from here this instance and this is going to print only date right so if I run it so see we got the time current time this is number of hours number of minutes and this is number of seconds now second time we have got only date which is extracted from this local date time now second thing if you have a calendar instance right which is from jdk older version so calendar calendar equal to sorry, calendar then calendar has a method is called get instance so you got the calendar instance again in similar fashion you can create local instance local date time from calendar as well so what jdk what jdk what java engineers have done they have added a similar method in calendar as well so again you have a two instant method right look at here which is written in instance of instant instant and we got the instance of local date time again if you want to convert into local date or local time so similar fashion you can convert it but i'm going to just print the value of local date local date time to which go, uh, which we got from the calendar instance and sorry right. so we got the output successfully right so if you have a if you want to convert i mean from older date api to new date api that is called local date time so easily you can convert in this way even if you have a calendar instance if you want to convert into local date time so this is the way to convert it so i hope you enjoyed learning this video in next video tutorial we are going to explore some more things related to java date time api which has been added in jdk 1.8 so please be with me over there and thanks for watching this video.